Oh, how strange. What the hell? Watching YouTube on you. Fuck. Uh, YouTube won't load. Okay, that's loaded it that way. There we go. There we go. One, two, 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 ten, 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 two, 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 ten. Just saved the village, man. Hello, Natty. Where are we Assuming going? Assuming it is not too busy, you might even miss Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. Indeed. I don't know if I got that or not, because the cutscene kicked in at the exact same time. Oh, we saw this last night. Last time. Have I got to do all this again? That's a little recap. You said you could get to the Chub when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who's this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Yeah, they come in, they start flexing, and you get the it's Game of Thrones moment. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. I saved it after this. I distinctly remember saving the game. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. You know what? I'm going to take this opportunity. It's my first time here. It's welcome. welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Butterbeer? On you, eh? Very good, Heard very about good, the attack. Very good. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thank you for this. My pleasure. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Oh. Not timely. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sir Ryan. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the calibre of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, 
my friend is yes. busy. Well, I got back up, bro. Enough bloodshed for one day. I got back up. Come, the ovenous. In my manner now, mate. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butter beer forever. Want to bet? Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Nat will watch my back. I'll watch it. Trolls, Ranrock and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. I agree. I agree. To Hogwarts. Night falls. Luminoso. Lumos. That's it. Lumos. It's got a FOV say. I am certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Rookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. Good thinking. You must return to your common room for the night. Access the map. Select Hogwarts map, switch to Hogwarts map. Last travel to your common room. Ding dong ding dong ding dong ding ding dongy ding dong do dingle berries come in groups they make the dingle juice nearly there nearly there nearly there one second Lulu I'm right with you we've nearly finished chopping chopping complete Toadie sent me a message yesterday saying I knew you'd be Hufflepuff. And uh, I hadn't even thought of that. <laughs> it hadn't even crossed my mind. You've received an owl post. Hey, speaking of Toadie, Bo's just sent me a little message. Owl post will be sent when current teacher might have requests or updates. Select Professor Fig. Come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket. We found at Gringotts. This is a perfect Sunday game. I love a game that gives you a slow walking speed, man. They know how good their game looks. They want you to drink it in. There was a period uh, when a few games gave you a walk button. You'd hold out one to walk slower. Um, I can't quite remember what games did it. I think one of the Assassin's Creed games did it. Still guarding the cakes, man. Nice one, nice one. Uh, what are you telling me to come to the common room for if I've got to leave? Oh, that was just to get my mail, is it? Okay. Bum, 
How can I see my uh, fast travel points? They're, they're not flags, obviously, are they? Both flue flames locations. I can't go onto them. Side quest now available. Oh, I was already at it. So then you have to find the flame. Gotcha. Okay. Right, got it. So I couldn't see him because you have to click on the location first. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh, I've forgotten it by next stream, but for now we've got it. I'll be back in a minute. Hello Don't there. worry. Hello. Perhaps you can help me. Perhaps I can. Perhaps oi. I can. Can you help me? I say oi, mate. That's a bit rude, Mr. Plumley. Hello. Why are you calling me? I was, yes. Thought perhaps a fellow Hufflepuff might have the perseverance to join me in a bit of an adventure. Oh, following a treasure map to be precise slight respite from battling the odd troll i should think ask poppy if she'd be interested as well but couldn't drag her away from her puff skein i found two maps lying about both leading to locations around hogwarts care to have a look at one yes i would care to have a look at one following a hogwarts treasure map count me in <laughs> wonderful Hogwarts fascinates me. You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Where do you suggest I search first? Hmm. Based on a cursory review of your map, I'd suggest somewhere near Hecate's classroom. Cheers. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair enough. Meet me back here if you find anything. Um, right. Outside, this is... I remember that. There's a thing behind it with a mirror with a thing on the top where you do a thing and then a thing on the rhino thing. Okay, well, we'll figure it out. Don't worry. Thank you, uh, Plumsley. Hi. Where's Professor Fig? Oh, I know, you can do that thing. Wait, 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 wait. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Press up on the D-pad. No path available for open quest objectives. What? Oh, is that, have I just accepted that side quest? That's why, isn't it? What's this inventory? I've got something. That's my map. Okay, yeah, I just got Arthur's quest and I've probably changed quest. Yes, I have. Back to that. Professor Fig. La 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 Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to? They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade. 
with Rookwood. The trolls were running off distractions said, so that Rookwood could get to me, and he would have had Sarona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. He would have. This is a great three news broomsticks indeed. Have intervened. If Ranrocks, oh. goblins, and dark wizards are after you, they oh. want what we found in that vault. God damn it! Just put my lighter down there. Ah. Uh. Uh. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure. But I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. The restricted section, to be precise. And a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. But sir, how dangerous anyway. could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Cheers, Teach. Something fluttering around. Revelio. Bam, 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 bam. Dress like this as well. Hello, where's my damn coat? Thank you. I must reset your clothes every time you uh, restart to get it. Load your save. Oh, wait, 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 the rhino, huh. there was a thing. The rhinoceros skeleton, I'm on the right track. There was the thing, there's a picture somewhere, I've got to do the grabby Tell thing on it. student would help me with my sad predicament. I'll up you in a minute, Zenobia. Just a minute. Okay, what are you saying? Are you all right? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Noak, the girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. That's me. Join the club. I'm sorry to hear that. I'm sorry the other students weren't more friendly. That's kind of you. I suppose there are a few decent souls here. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Gobstones? Sounds like a fun challenge. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, <laughs> it's their own fault for losing. Exactly. Imelda is one of the worst Don't losers. Don't play the game, man. 
ever written a story were terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. <sighs> Rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year to help me. Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. <laughs> Whoever hid my Fair gobstones enough, that Genobia. high got up there somehow. Fair enough. I'll wait till I got my, uh, my broomstick. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. Why can't I look at that? Oh, there we go, view. Right, look at the thing. Rhinoceros. By its nose. Then there's a fucking door behind the ball thing. That's outside in the courtyard. And then I gotta do something with a, a picture of a house in some woods. Revelia. Oh shit. Um <laughs> shit. Was that I don't think I was supposed to do that. Rebuild it. Can I do the rebuild? Repair. 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 Um okay. Back to that later. Hello. Um, where am I going? Because I've to spoke to her. I forget, whenever you speak to somebody, you take their uh, quest automatically. Smuggling spiders into school? I jolly well hope it was worth the months of detention you earned yourself. Do yourself a favor and get a real pet, a cat or a toad or. Just a toad? Something normal. Sake. Oh. What the hell was This large dragon skeleton that hangs in the defense against the dark arts classroom is allegedly a trophy taken by Professor Hecat after she single handedly defeated one of the largest poaching rings in eastern Wales during the Great Poacher Raid of 1878. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell, handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, 
and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. You know where to find me once you've finished. So you tell me what to do. Seems crossed ones isn't as secret as it's believed to be. Bum, ba, dum, bum. Win two rounds of crossed ones. Something wild going on over there. Ready for another round? Oh yeah. I think so. We shall see who shows up. There's no one in the school I'd be afraid to duel. I know, Sebastian. I know. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Crossed Ones all set? Why, yes it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Can't remember how to play. Triangle in it to parry. I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? Spam R2 to fire back and then they give circle to stop them from shielding to float them up. Yeah. Wait. You mean two on two? Yeah, two on two. Let's do it. Yes, Natty. Then let's get to it. Yeah, with the troll. Ready to get thrashed? Yeah, with the troll killers, mate. You picked on Apologies the wrong people. Apologies in advance. You picked on the wrong people. Maybe you didn't hear. Break through violet shields and full spells like summoning charm, Akio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Yeah. Don't worry about it, mate. Take care. Natty. By the way, why is he three on two? No! 
Oh, that tap down to heal. Shit. Oof. Go again. Glad I didn't bet on you that round. Catch, go again. Yeah, a little warm up. I just forgot. Come on. I'll give it another go. Glad to hear it. Yeah, I know how to play it. I was just warming up. Come on. Bullshit. She's fucking glitched. Glitched. Thank you. I gave it my all. You did indeed. Purple spell for purple yeah, shield. Yeah, I was I was being a big. How you doing, Bean? Last round. They'll really purple spell, have it purple in shield. for you. Got it, got it, got it. You'd better keep Color practicing code. if you want a chance of winning, or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. The joypad's constantly. I think because uh, the cutscene came on when I was really damaged, it's constantly fucking buzzing. Stop buzzing, please. Oh no, it's still doing it. Uh, let me turn it off and on. That's not going to work, is it? Because the game's obviously telling it to. Hang on a sec. No, it's still doing it. I need to heal or travel or something. Let me fast travel, see if that works. Goes up when I'm on here. Yeah, how you doing, Bean? You alright? Uh, questions. Back to Professor Heckart. Yeah, I might have reloaded the game here. Hi, I'm running dungeons in Final Fantasy. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Don't need of to course. Use... Stop it! I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try tingly. now? Later, later, later. Actually, I might come back later. Suit yourself. I'll be around when you're ready. Well, I need to. I need to quit out. I hope that goes off when I come back in. Running dungeons. What's that? Just are you on the grind? Is that what you're doing? You're grinding, yeah? How many years have you been playing that game now? Yes, fixed it. Nice. 
bum, bum, bum. Why is it telling me to go back to it? Oh, it's not his. Not grinding. There's a journal that gives you tasks in order to get goodies. Right. Perhaps I should stick to potions. Wait a minute. What does it want me to go? Have I got to use the training dummy? I must have to use the training dummy. Hello, Lucan. I'm ready for practice. Glad you're keeping at it. Ready to have a try now? Apparently. That would be wonderful. Playing the game since April 2020. If you need to stop right. practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. So you're not an early adopter, are you? How long has it been out? Keep trying. What have I got to do? What did he tell me to do? Oh, there we go. You'll get it. What am I doing, bro? Oh, I see at the top. Then what? Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Definitely. You looked good out there. Thanks. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Cheers, mate. Why is my... Assignment's all finished. Why is my default stance hunched over? Oh, it's not now. When she stands, it's normal. When you stop running, she's got all that hunched stance. I don't like it. I'm not 83 years old. Seems I'm out of the tournament thanks to you. Uh, get good. You could have gone a bit easier on me. Get good. <laughs> get good, guys. You scrubs. Broomstick today, by the way. Head's a different colour, isn't it? What's going on with that? Something. Something going on. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you found success in your endeavours. Of course. I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hecate. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that Fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. So I'll just so we get rid of purple one, innit? 
Good work. Oh, there's lots. No, wait. Which is the one that catches things? That's that one, isn't it? I need that one. So, but I need that one as well. Okay, I guess we... Wait, it can only have four? Done it. What are you telling me to do it for? Done it. I've done it, game. Stupid. Where's spells? Where the fuck is it? I just broke the fucking game. Where's spells? To use a spell on item, first time you see it, hover over and you. Bro, I did it! Look, I've got the fucking thing. Have I got to hit you with it? And do try not to incinerate yourself. Thanks. It takes ages for filler. Is that it? We're done? Yeah, I think I've bugged the game out. Excellent defensive skills. Let me reload it. I'm going to go to the toilet anyway. I'm back in a sec. Confounded face. What happened? Not nining. Yet, face with tears of joy. Face blue smiling. There we go. Broke the seal.
TMI. Probably TMI. Hey, Bean, I'm, I forgot I wanted to uh, ask you something. Um, I need some scenic routes through Germany. I got this game. Yeah, let me show you something first. Hang on here. Check this out. I spent my Dragon's Dogma money on a wheel stand instead. And I got this game called Fern Bus, which is about this, it's like a bus company in Germany called Flixbus, Flixbus. And you can drive all around Germany on it like, and I thought that you might know some scenic routes. Well, probably not. Yeah. Right, upstairs. Follow the thing. Downstairs? Down and up, okay. It's a coach company for travelling through Germany. Yeah, I think all across Europe, actually, because this game, you can go France, Germany, Austria, Switzerland. They've just added Poland DLC. You can go Denmark. Um, it's pretty good. They also go to some cities in Germany's neighborhood. So the game's got like a sort of condensed version, obviously, of the country. I only like, used it twice for going to Berlin, too. It's got a lot of major cities, and then it'll have certain landmarks and um, things. We could check out your, your closest city. You might see something recognizable on there. Ah, there you are. Hey, Hogwarts Legacy is great to watch here. How are you going, Roman? We're going well, thank you. Pink Fire Heart, that's a uh, thingy, isn't it? Um, Alana, yeah? How you doing, Alana? Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Hecate. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, it's a perfect shall Sunday we afternoon game as well. Fig, I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule. Your is... schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office. Five minutes. I'm fine. Thanks for asking. That man Open is up an hour ago, so I didn't do much so far. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor, we oh, have no hours. choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. And all I've done today is have some bacon oat cakes. Hey, so you can visit the bus stations in the cities. I'm not sure they are super beautiful, to be honest. <coughs> Deep. No, man, you can drive around the cities as well. So there's certain, like, um, for instance, in Paris, you can go to the Arc de Triomphe, Eiffel Tower, um, the Louvre, Notre Dame. La Défense. Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Bring, bringy, bring, bring, bring. Sebastian. 
Sebastian, there you are. I was hoping to see you. I was in the three broomsticks after the troll attack and saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? Listen, first of all, have you got my back? Because I didn't see you jump into the front of the queue to defend me in that pub. So I hope you weren't hiding behind the table. TV power. There we go. Then, or the focus looked dental monument to the battle of nations. In there you Leipzig. go. There you go. We can look for some of them next time. I'm, if, hey, if you see me playing, come on and jump on and tell me, and we'll look if they're on the game. It tells you what are on there, so we can go visit them. It's basically the console's version of Euro Truck Simulator. It's the closest thing we've got at the moment, anyway. Seems he's working with Ranrock. And Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Ranrock? And when were you at Gringotts? Professor Fig and I ended up there after the dragon attack. It's quite the tale. Loving Fig this rig, though. Also maybe the Hex and Hands Blades, which is dance sure floor on the mountain called Brocken. There. Yeah, there's some nice mm, mountain sections. We ended sections. up in an ancient vault where we found a map. That map leads to the restricted section. You can't be serious. Deadly serious. Professor Fig has insisted that I not tell a soul about any of this. You have to get back on Gran Turismo now as well. I've probably said too much. Understood. And Your Formula One. safe with me. Whatever it is. Thank you, Sebastian. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. 400 and quid, Gran Turismo 7's cost me. Meet me outside the library tonight and tell it's The no most one. expensive video game I've ever bought. I mean, I would never have bought it if I didn't have the VR, but obviously, because it's one of the best VR games, I bought the game. But when you buy the game, you have to buy the stream wheel. Now I bought the stream wheel, you have to buy the stand. So it's cost me 400 fucking quid, Gran Turismo 7 has. Almost as much as the fucking VR itself cost. <laughs> uh, see you tonight, bro. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. Jesus Christ. I know. It's going to cost me even more because... This, when this PC VR thing comes out later this year, I'm going to have to get a PC as well. Because there's so much PC VR stuff I'd want to play. VR is going to be the most expensive thing I've ever bought in the, at the end of the day. See there? Boom, boom. That's the door we need to reach. And those I can't imagine being without a PC, to be honest. How do you people manage so to do that? Bean, I'm going to blow your mind. Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. I'm going to blow your mind in a minute. Charm. Good for getting places Disney. you're not supposed there to be. There must be something you don't know about. Cast me. it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean, I'll actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. Give it a try. I don't have a phone. I haven't had a phone since 2010, 14 years. Well, it would have been about late 2010 I got rid of it. So almost 14 years I haven't had a phone. So if you don't know how I can survive without a PC, I have a landline for my mum and grandma. D. Me too. <coughs> but <coughs> I've got a tablet. Everything I need, my tablet does so. Um, there's no reason to get a computer really until now, until this VR thing crossover. And the mobile, because convenience, I guess I could give up my mobile, but not my PC. Like, there's nothing really that... That I can't get from my tablet and my console that a PC would give me that I want or quote-unquote need. Um, but now, like I say, with this VR thing, I do need it. I've got to play Elite Dangerous, Grand Theft Auto, Microsoft Flight Simulator, Formula One, this there's like a VR mod for this 
all kinds of shit. Anyway, jump. Oh, can I not jump over there? Come on, levitate us. Right, I forgot what I'm doing here. Oh yeah, I'm sneaky, sneaky, sneak, sneak. Sense invis. Okay, okay, okay. Run away. How do I sneak? What's the invisible button? I use the PC for basically everything. I have my music library on it. Gaming, of course. Writing program, internet. What's the invisible button? Rebellion. Why is that come up again? That stupid fucking thing there. Use a spell. I do. I've already done this. Hold R two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Press triangle. Yeah. Done it, mate. All right. Fuck off. All right. Where's this invisible thing? Is this it? Right. I've got to do this as well. Okay. I've got to put it on. Let's go. Now you see me. Now you don't see us. How long does it last? Long enough. Plenty long enough. Lost. Librarian's still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. Bro, I'm invisible. Chill out. What are you worried about? Librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, but it'll still be all right. Stay Do you invisible. see her desk behind me? The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. I'll meet you outside of the restricted section. Okay, you just walk. Next dungeon. You just walk past the desk while you were invisible. Why didn't you gate then, you daft sod? Next dungeon, go on, Bean. Isn't there a spell for this? Aloha Mora. That's how I always used to get it. Aloha but the librarian Mora. twigged Such that I knew the spell and fish. cast an anti Aloha Mora charm Aloha on the lock. Mora. So it's now it's just this key. But don't worry. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Days. Trust Aloha me. Mora. Aloha Mora. What am I doing? Getting the key. What the hell? There's someone there. Is that you, Peeves? What are you doing this way for? Get down the middle. Thank you. Hello, Ahamora. Great balls of fire. I got it. That wasn't so difficult after all. Now to find that book. Oh, that one's charm to look more useful than it is. It's fooled me twice. Never judge a tome by its cover, I say. Hey. Use basic cast while we have to Okay. So Ghost. Don't let her see you. What? Where, bro? Oh, yeah. Hello, Ahamora. No! Don't come over here. Oh shit. Oh shit. Go over there. Thank you. Very much, Lee. Should be in the clear. No need for us to be skulking about. 
So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne, so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else is doing it. Why do you think you'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? We've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mongo's. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you're after. Avelia. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it first. Best to avoid these books if possible. Do you not as much to their tendency to fly from one's hands as to their content being spectacular drivel of no educational value whatsoever? You're being awfully Lewis. cryptic. Why is there a red thing hanging from this? What? How was that? Rebellion. Oh, is that the ghost? That's the ghost in it. Lumos. Lumos. Copycat. Oh, I mean. Lumos. What the noise that makes, man? Almost like an owl. Oh. Lumos. Lumos. Who have we here? Kill Jester. Solo and his new little friend. Out exploring where they shouldn't be. Naughty, naughty. You'll get caught. Peeves, don't you. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. Oh, blasted peeves! I've got to stop him, or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. Now go. Good luck in your search. Now. Where's that damned poltergeist got to? Is it too obvious that he's going to be the bad guy? Like I know just the obvious. spell to repair this armor. You do, but unfortunately we can't have it bloody on all the time. So I have to remember where they all are. Repair it. I if we could have um, just a little mini hold R2. A little wheel comes up and then use the stick to choose one of like eight or nine on a wheel. Anyway, it is what it is. Of course, traces of ancient magic. But then there must be more to this room. Lumos. Rebellion. Lumos. Gear slots are full. You can sell access gear at vendors.
I wear those now. Black rivet gloves. Little swans on the fingers. Nice. Seen Empire Strikes Back. Where might this lead? To the Athenium, I reckon. Hey, not you, buggers. Not surprising. Guards at the ready. Say what now? Are you getting back up? Gift of ancient magic accumulates. Successful 10 hit combos will begin generating ancient magic power ups. Collecting these will greatly fill your ancient magic meter and recover a small amount of health. Right, is that the blue fit? Yeah, there it is, blue thing. 7 times 8 times 9 times 10, 11. Alright, thanks. Well, at least the segment's full. Okay, that's what I just did, the L1R1. Got it, got it, got it. Sweet. Lumos. <laughs> Every location, man. Every inch of this damn game.
This must be the way forward. But to where? Lumos. That must be a comeback later thing. Maybe I get to jump for a uh, bigger double jump later or something. That must be for a double jump. I imagine. Nearly there. Oh shit! Let's keep not. my wits around me. Oh! Piss pots. So hang on. Maybe not then. Take it. Surely I can still take it, right? Wait, what? Hang on a minute. Gear slots are full. What are you talking about? Gear slots. Just. That's all I've got. Four. Right, destroy. Fuck, man. Uh, destroy. Yes. You get more bag space by doing the Merlin things outdoors. Right, so before when I found something, that thing's still in the chest. I need to go back and find it again. Damn, what do I get rid of then? I guess that, because it's boring. So I'm, I'm going to have to make sure I've got at least one slot and everything here. Uh... I ain't ever wearing them pyjamas, mate. Get rid of them. <laughs> them pyjamas can go. Right. So surely I've got gear slots now, right? So I can pick this up, yeah? Right, i got a tan nightcap. Get in the fucking bin. That was pointless. Right. I'm not a fan of this, by the way. Having to do this every goddamn however many bloody minutes. Right, see you later, mate. But uh, we'll deal with it. No problem. Ain't no thing. Lumos. Poacher's coat. That might be cool. And a royal Chinese. I'll just throw one of them away. So I've got to come in here every bloody time now just to make sure I've got a slot. 
Wait, I can sell it for night. Wait, 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 wait. Ninety, ninety. Beige. See you later, beige. You're only worth thirty. Right, flog all that shit. Where's that coat? Coat. Oh, that sounded alright. That poacher's coat. Oh yes. Are you fucking kidding me? Is the gear random in this, or is this always in that chest? If this is a random pickup, I've already won the game. It's got tusks, like my old coat used to have when I was a kid. Toggles. Tusk toggles. Fucking yes. Fashion soul's complete. Forgetting the heal. Okay, the combat's quite forgiving. I thought I'd have to fight them all again then. I like that. It I want is it to be a bug after all. Lumos. Good nature, bro. First rule. You wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor McCaw. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year, I've never heard of another like us. Miss Morganog, 
When we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic Fucking everywhere crazy, that day. Man. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but Just it was my certainly imagination. real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too. But we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself oh, is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But. Let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganach. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. No, no. A magic this powerful. She's going do dark side. Harm She's going to be hands. like. Uh, it must boss. be wielded by a select few. As such, we ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. That record guy. He'll have a word with her on the sly. Um, thingy settings from fucking Charlie and the Chocolate Slugworth settings. Sebastian. Because that other guy's name is Rookwood, wasn't it? That other bad guy. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. Yeah. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. Peeves is a smelly grass. If someone has come alone, she's got stitches, bro. I don't know if you heard me. that or not in the school before, but. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. Kill Jester. There was nobody else. I came alone. Go on, Sally, and you can trust you, bro. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs> oh, Seb. Where you at, bro? Hello? Everybody gone? A rugged fedora? I don't know fucking rugged fedora, mate. <laughs> I'll flog it. Professor Black, might, su might I suggest a ban on magic in the library? Somebody has been sneaking into the restricted section and Cressida Bloom seems to think of the library as her own person. What the fuck was that? Hello. Automation. And the Gunder. Lumos. It's coming for all your jobs, man. Per Angusta ad Augusta. Ignis orum probat. Docendo disismus. I don't understand Latin, so. Doctrina perpetua. Perpetual doctrine. Pero. Oh, we went that way. The thing is, anyone, the pages. Revelio. The library has no pages. Revelio. La, la, la. 
orange eye of newt got. Hey, that's from that geezer from the film, isn't it? Is it? Oh, I need to find a moth. There must be a moth in here. Lumos. Will it just come to me if I get close to it? They won't put it too far away because you have to take it all the way back to the mirror. So it'd probably be in the room at least. Might be downstairs. Must be downstairs. Oh, you seen a moth anywhere? No. It's, is that it? Where is it, little bugger? Wait, was it like uh, on the wall the first time? Oh shit, Bean, are you there? Bean will know. It might have been on the wall and I got it off the wall. What was that? Money. I'm here. You know them, the little butterflies you have to take to the mirrors? Are they fluttering about or are they like ornaments at first and then you bring them to life? Because one of the mirror things in here, but I can't see where the butterfly is. I don't seem to be able to revelio it. Revelio. They're always close to the mirror. They're always quite close, yeah. I would imagine quite quite close, because you've got to walk back with them like. Oh well, the mirror's just down here. Right up there. That is one, isn't it? Look. Is that one or not? Or does it just show all these mirrors? Does it have to have a butterfly missing? Or is that the missing one in the middle, the big one? <laughs> I'm not sure how it works. I wasn't paying attention. Right, so presumably it'd be in here somewhere, right? Pavelio. I don't know. Forget it. Forget it. Right. Find a second landmark from office treasure map. Oh, we can do that. It didn't show you the place in the mirror. Oh, does it? Right. Yeah. Does it normally do that? Revelia. Yeah. So this, does that mean it's not a magic mirror, it's just a normal mirror? What's it there for then? Why is it highlighted? Can I break it or something? And then... No. No, it's magic, but it's not doing what it's usually doing and it's weird. Oh. Hang on then, let's uh... I played this game a year ago, so I don't know what to do. <laughs> we'll try it next time we come in here. If it's still the same, then I'll, I'll, I'll look into it. I don't think it's a big deal anyway. Right, we need... Reading can be as magical as any spell. Why can't students see that? Alright. It's your job to make them see that. Maybe if you weren't such a grumpy guts. Be a bit, show a bit more enthusiasm. It'll rub off on the pupils. It 
a relief to finally have an answer as to why that portrait was empty. Keeping well, I hope. I am. Oh. Where are the courtyards now? I need to go to the courtyards. That's the way out, isn't it? Like to the whatever. That looks like an outer door. This looks more like an inner door. Or maybe that was an outer door. Here, courtyard. I'd better yeah, keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstone. There's the fountain. I'm getting closer. Now the last one was a painting of something. Um, let me see. It was in inventory over here. This one. Get that. Fountain. Something behind the fountain. Behind a tree. There's a painting. Pull the painting. Uh, right. Tree. With a door. No tree. So it's this Lumos. way. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Where are my GB? Yes, I was waiting for you to wake up, man. I thought there's no point playing Jedi early because I, I didn't think you'd be uh, here now what time is it now for you it's still it's only 9am for you right so I thought I'll play that later man when he's up and about and that isn't it like 9am where you are Alpha this stairwell looks promising I thought you ain't going to want to watch streams at 9am 9.07am yeah I thought who watches that you know what I mean and so I thought, if I put it on now, we'll be in bed, or we'll be having his breakfast, or we'll do him. keep an eye out in high places for Linovia's gobstones. Same, Liam. Same, bro. I also need to do this. I don't know where the fuck I'm going. I'm just wandering around in the wrong way, I think. But I need to go up there, look. Let's go up there. I tend to wake up more early when I'm back home. Got you. Way? It's telling me to go that way. What the hell? Oh, it's a different way. Enjoy having luck down by the end. Uh, how you doing, Liam? Hope you're well. Same to you, Alpha. Yeah, so I think I'll probably play this for another hour or so, Alpha. Mm -hmm. Take an hour break. Mm -hmm. um, well, Jedi Survivor will probably be tonight's stream. So it'll be later, man. Unless you're busy. Um, it'll be a bit later. I got that already, didn't I? Get in the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah! Cool, cool. Yeah, I haven't seen one of them gobstones yet, um, Liam. What do they look like, man? Seen this coat, dude? I bet you haven't got this coat, have you? Can't really see it because of the light, but there we go. Lumos. It doesn't really help. Poacher's coat. I'm not exactly sure. I think just round fours, but the only one I got was by accident. Ah. Uh. Made against trolls. You know, there is such a thing as trying too hard. I guess you could say for expecting me to not be here this early. 
There you go. A wizard is never late, nor is he early. He arrives precisely when he means to. As does an alpha. Of course, brother. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Orthodox. It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted section, as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Oh. Oh, dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful. Though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? In the second, they were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic, too. Why those memories? Hmm. Perhaps this book will explain. Perhaps. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Listen. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. Has the world opened up to me now? Can I just fuck off out if I want to? And just go and explore the Highlands? Or can I only wander around Hogwarts and Hogsmeade at the moment? Yeah. Uh, I can. I might just fuck off out for a bit. It's time to prove your dueling metal and see if we've a new school champion. Meet me you, at the usual place for the you final round of You hang on, stop distracting also, me. the training dummy is still available. Stop distracting me. Right. Meet me in Lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. I would like to talk to you Perfect. about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. Not been Hogsfield yet. Perfect. Let's go there. Perfect, a hamlet. Open map. Perfect timing. Um, because, yeah, I want to go have a little wander around in that. <laughs> I think I've literally unlocked it now, just as, <laughs> just as I was asking about it. Um, okay. How much find new opportunities for vendors, flu flames, high quests, and collectibles? Low Hogsfield is located in the countryside in the closest hamlet to Hogwarts with reverence to the school that taught them all. The inhabitants decided on the name Hogsfield, however, uh, sorry, however, around the same time the villagers of Upper Hogsfield also opted for the name Hogsfield after Hogsmeade. Thus an unhappy compromise was decided upon in each village added a qualifier. Three chests, one statue, 
Exit field guide. As you explore, you move fog. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Later. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. Lessons later. Right, anything else? Okay, quest. Pick the natty one, because I think you that's probably... You can off to your heart's content. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to furk off right now to my heart's content. Where's quest? Is that quest? Right, where is she? There we go. That's actually a main quest. But that'll just get me to the new place at least. Right. But would you suggest probably stick with the story for a bit anyway? Because I'm going to want a broomstick, right? For travelling. Or some kind of mount. I wish I could jump over here. I hopped out and explored a lot. Yeah. Let me have a little wander now. See what we can find. I mean, there's still plenty more to see in here. Obviously, we're going to go to two new wings, or at least one new wing now. Because I've not seen those classrooms before yet. Pathology and potions. So, plenty more to explore inside Hogwarts itself. But I'm getting stir-crazy, man. I need to go outside a little bit. This is the first year my kid. Run through the fields. With my rape and quests will get you to plan. Yeah. And such quicker for more efficient exploring, but take your time if you want. Take your time with it. Take your time with it. Exactly. See, not been out here yet. Lovely. Bang. <sighs> you know how clean that air is as well, up there. Feels different as it goes in the lungs, man. Unlucky. You get it next time. Keep at it, keep at it. You'll get it, you'll get it. I promise. Is the music a bit low? Should it be louder? Or am I tripping? No, I must be tripping. So the tower up there, man. Not in part of Hogwarts, is it? Oh yeah, I need that fucking unlockiest, lockiest, <laughs> unlockiest padlockiest. I need it. Oh, do. What are you looking at? That's the owlery. The owlery. Clues are there. I should have known. Alright. 
Alright, calm down, calm down. Well, I'm gonna have to go up there now, won't I? I said you were too cute to pick yesterday, but I'm probably going to have to pick you at some point. I know you're going to say, you're going to say you can't go up there until you get your broomstick. There's no way up. see a bridge <laughs> now I see a bridge and what a bridge it is Bridges. I used to know a girl who proper loved bridges. I used to be like, what? What are you talking about bridges, man? I understand. No. I didn't understand 20 years ago. Now I understand why she liked bridges. Billy boats graphic. It is. That's what I was thinking. Should check underneath it for a troll, man. Wait, is that the right thing? Or have I just got two mixed up? Yeah, Billy Goat's Gruff with the troll, isn't it? And butt him off the edge in that. Hickory striped robe. Looks okay. Looks ancient. But check my coat out. It's not getting warm. Is that okay? Okay. 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 So if all I came for. <laughs> You know what? If all I came for is to look at you pretty elves, it was worth it. I'll have a look at you on the way back down. Just give me a second. See if there's some loot up here. Oh, nice, nice. There you go. Yeah. Bam, ba, ba, bam, ba, ba. Yeah. What do these do? Do these actually do anything? Why has he got like, um... Revelia. You have to levitate it. Let me open. Oh, you do. They've got a little mark on them. Right, okay. And the little mark will relate to a certain spell, right? Got it. No. Got it. Owls and owls owned by students can be found in the Hogwarts Owlery. One is advised to explore carefully, keeping an eye out for owl droppings and regurgitated mouse skeletons. Hello. Yeah. 
Oh, sorry. I was trying to think of an owl joke. I know an owl joke, and I can't remember where it is. It's probably best that I can't remember it. You have to deal with some poop and skeletons to have our friends. So be it. So be it indeed. Small price to pay. Oh, look at that bridge. I might watch the uh, films today. I forgot last night. I might watch a film in between this and uh, Jedi stream. Buy some ice cream. Sit and watch a Harry Potter film with a tub of ice cream. Time to little clothes on a Sunday. Time to little clothes on a Sunday. Anybody, anybody know? Stop it! I'm barely touching you. Jesus, it's so sensitive. The R2 button. It's not just touching it, not pressing it. Can't they just cast poop cleaning spells on the floor? Yeah, they could, man. They've got all the other stuff going on. They could definitely do that. They could have an auto owl poop cleaner in there. Just like they had for the stamp in the library books. We have to keep in mind to never give you a gun next Never, week. ever. I'd never have one. I'd never want to have a gun anyway. So you don't have to worry, Bean. Something wild happened to me the other night. It's kind of put me off going for them walks they for a little bit. Four on Sundays. Four. Oh fuck them! It's already they already closed. Check this out, right? The other night. I was at a shooting range once with a former colleague. It was about three in the morning the other night, right? I was just making some supper and that. And I just thought I'm just going to go out in the garden and get some fresh air. So I just went out the kitchen door, walked through my catio, closed the catio behind me, took about five steps towards the garden. Went like that. The wind blew at me, right? And I suddenly went fucking absolutely perishing, freezing cold that I, I wanted to go back in. Before I could get to the catio door, like literally five steps away, I'd started spasming like this. Fucking, I'd like, all my body had tightened up to fuck. And I was spasming. I could barely breathe. My chest was starting to hurt. I managed to get to the catio door, lifted the latch off it and that. But I couldn't fucking get the bolt back across. It took me about five or six seconds to get the bolt back in. I'm walking back in the house, and my fucking arms, I couldn't move them, sort of spasming. I got a bit panicky, like I thought I was fucking dying or something. <clears throat> I had to put, I put my hands under the hot water tap, try to get some warmth back in my body quick. And after about five minutes or so, like, I'd started to get back to normal, but fucking freaked me out, man. Never had anything like it in my life. Sitting was telling you no. I'd gone from normal, yeah, I'd gone from normal, right, to absolutely shit scared in seconds i've never had anything like it i've tried to look it up online can't see nothing about it like i got i just kept thinking like hyperthermia first stage of hyperthermia but i literally Crazy. walked out of that. i'd been outside less than 30 seconds and this wind just hit me and it like i remember it hitting my spine and my chest and i'm just thinking fuck that's cold i'm going back inside and I'm turning around and I don't think it was some kind of anxiety thing or something, but my body just started fucking shutting down right mad. It was fucking weird, man. Well, the first thing I thought, obviously, is... Imagine if that happens when I'm out on one of these walks or something. I'd be fucked. Um, 
So, I'm going to look into it a bit more. I tried to recreate it last night. I went back out again last night, but uh, I was all right last night. <coughs> it was fucking wild, man. Like a head rouge, low blood sugar type thing. No, to be honest, I didn't feel dizzy or faint or anything like that. I just felt really tight and like my body was just fucking... You know, you read about when, when hypothermia supposedly kicks in, the body does some crazy thing. People like take their clothes off and shit. And I felt like I wasn't in control of myself, man. I felt like I was fucking a robot. <laughs> I was like even walking a bit like a robot because my arms were sort of stuck in like that, right tight as I was trying to walk. It was fucking weird, man. It was so weird. Has this got an actual day-night cycle? It has, hasn't it? Like, it's, it's turning into night right now. I better get a move on. From warm to cold too quickly. Might have been. It might have been. And then maybe, I don't know, something in my brain just panicked itself or... I don't really know, mate. It's fucking weird. Levioso. Do I need a different spell for that? I've obviously got to put it on there. Oh, incinerate. No. Oh. So push the block on there, then set it on fire, got you. Who's that mysterious figure on the end of the pier? In fact, they're just having a ponder, actually. Nothing mysterious about them. Oh, okay, Grace Pinch Smedley. Lumos. Hello, can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes, my name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath Pinch Smedleys? I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was impressed that you can actually swim in this game instead of just dying in the water like in many other games. Same. You see, Remember thinking the same thing I when I jumped in for the first time from the bottom of the lake. day one. Might you be the one to help me? Uh, I did try to dive, though, and I couldn't. But now she's telling me to go to the bottom, so maybe there is a diving mechanic sounds like fun diving into the lake sounds like an adventure tell me more splendid tell me more precisely tell me the response more. i'd hoped for what do you need help retrieving what's on years the ago river my bed. grandfather who fancied himself quite the astronomer mm. set sail from hogsmeade station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother they never returned i'm so sorry what happened to them we can't be sure we she didn't sound like a girl from Bath. She had a fifth Bristol accent. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever Bath. again. I want listen, the treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. Just do it. Should I know your family? Do I care? I don't really care. It sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand. But I'd be forever grateful. Of course, you may discover much more than the astrolabe. Also, she said, Anything else not you bad. found would be all yours. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last Come alleged more. location the against the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. My best guess is that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's astrolabe back. I do hope you Wait. find the astrolabe. It would Did mean so much is... to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just Bristol, northeast yeah. of it's the like dock. Steve Merchant. Well, I should that, dive down and that, see. That kind of accent. Steve Merchant.
Wait, I can't use fucking Lumos at night. I'm not going to be able to see anything. How do I dive? Yeah, how do I dive? Pressed every button. Right, can I change the time of day? Or do I have to um, go and sleep in a bed to do that? Good question. Yeah, it didn't let me dive. We'll come back. We'll come back in the daytime. I think there are special spots in the water. Ah, I got you. That makes LRS sense. Up on the max screen. I hope you got you, got you. Rather eventful trip to Hogsmeade. Oh, I to am change well. time. But I have nice. been worried about you, my friend. With Ranrock and Rookwood and Harlow after you? I'm all right at the moment. We did not speak about it at the time, but I am hoping now you might tell me why they were looking for you. They want something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts. They take that scarf off. When were you at Gringotts? Um, Just before we came to Hogwarts. Coat. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. A port key brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form of ancient magic. Is that the magic you used fighting the trolls in Hogsmeade? I think so. I'm still learning. But I can see traces of it. And I've cast magic I can't otherwise explain. I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. And I will have more questions. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. I realized something that day in Hogsmeade. You displayed such courage fighting that troll. And Serona wasn't intimidated one bit by Rookwood and Harlow. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Good. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And the fact that they're working with Ranrock, well... All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true. But shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right. But how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. Yeah, you could have said that about half the time, to be honest, Natty. Uh, I but... beg your pardon. How dare you threaten me? What the fuck? What's going on here? What was that? They must have come this way. Think. I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood, don't Who's give a doctor's nip back your time. Oi, speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student, you can't. Oh, I miss Treadwell. Uh, Enough out of you. I'll take care Leave of this. Her alone. Stupid. Yes. Tag team. You Yo. I'll watch the light go out of your eyes. I wish I could see you a bit better. Uh, the collection section of uh, new enemy type. Okay, good. Beast uh, Stop right there! Oh, no. 
Fucking burns him alive. What on earth just wild. happened? I've never been accosted in such a manner. <laughs> been so close to Hogwarts. Lumos. How's it going? Just getting back in your spot, yeah? Hmm. 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 Want to talk to me? Okay. Are you all right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Combat's mm. quite enjoyable, isn't it? Well, I'll just say you have avoided to, um... them for the moment. Priya warned me things too much were getting too dangerous. Spanning. Can you upgrade Let's that normal R2 thing? Let's get moving on my research before they return. Well, should I have picked a stronger class, I guess, if I wanted to do more damage? Uh, how interesting research. Yeah, blah, You're blah, a researcher. Blah, 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 blah. Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian oh, and right. archaeologist no, right, specialising in Merlin's work and life. Yeah, so did I. I thought the Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were mere myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan didn't hear you. Chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. Is Merlin a thing in the Harry Potter universe anyway? Like, as a myth or real? I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little Merlin, secret. The, the no one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Yeah, Merlin was an actual wizard referenced in the Merlin books. Gotcha, right. He mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, Fair each enough. swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the centre. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the centre of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honours? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Suite with me. It's just over there by my tent. Up and down. In and out, the that's what United. makes the world go round. Uh, 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 uh. That's what makes the world go round. For every high, there is a low. For every two, there is a fro. For every, uh, 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 this trunk. Yes, take plenty, even down. if you already uh, have some. Uh, that's what I have the mallow suite. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swirl. Probably my favourite Disney film as a kid. Each Sword in the Stone. has these features. Place a proper the mallow suite on the swirl, and we'll see what happens. Until like Aladdin came along and they kind of broke the mould again. Sword in the Stone, man, I think was uh, my favourite. Probably the one I watched the most, for sure. 
I'm surprised I can't remember more of that song, to be honest. That's when they're swimming as the fish, I think. I just like when they were the squirrels. They fall in love, the little lady squirrel falls in love with him and that. Pretty cute. Uh, what am I doing? Sorry, I was singing Bloody Sword in the Stone songs. Come over here, yeah. Press, okay, press square. Did you see that? I did. The vines disappeared. What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these pyres. Incendio. You didn't think about that, yeah? The sink. I just said that gear slot thing again. Come on. Does that mean I just I would have got some Curious. gear there and I didn't? The pyres are back where they started. Fun fact. This film is a very bad hexy. I'm the Zorbara in German and it means the witch and the wizard. Yeah, because he fights uh, Mim. The magical Mim. The mysterious magical Mim. But, yeah, that's the best bit of the film. There he is. Where's Archimedes, man? I can hardly believe it. Pavelio. Oh. Yeah, but it's about Arthur and the sword. Yeah. I take it we can call that a success. We can indeed. However, oh. I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swell on the ground. You should Bean feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe. How I do I do that I bag need thing? To I, need to, um, I need to improve my bag. My guess is that slots. each will also require mallow suit, which you can find as soon in Hogsmeade. That, that, should you I need, need that more. to be my first thing? I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. Because it's leaving gear behind. And do be careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed, I shall return Some to the Some of it might be good, like that, I didn't even open a books. chest, I got it for activating this. So it's probably a special I'm piece of gear. Experience. From doing these trials. Right. Lumos. She's disappeared on me. So have I got more bags, bag space now, is that you what I said? Search and do the Merlin things, it's in your challenge book. You need a certain amount done. In the meantime, uh, sell the worst stuff in shops. Yeah. Um, is it under X quests? Uh, <laughs> uh, Merlin Childs, here we go. Inventory expansion reward. Right, oh, that's what that was then. So it wasn't telling me. It was telling me that I got an extra... Uh, okay. Okay. I thought it was telling me that I was full again. But it wasn't. It was telling me that I got some extra. Cool. I think. So how many have I actually got? Just three for gloves. Three for hats, I guess. This is fucking confusing. Why is this confusing me? Two for glasses. Is that right? One for scarves. No, one, two. What? Scarf, one, two. But shut up, man. How am I confused by a goddamn gear system? By the way, that ain't because I'm stoned. This would be confusing anyway. Let me get rid of this. And this. Is 90 gold a lot? How much gold have I got? Where's my gold? I've got... Don't fucking tell me how much gold I've got. Inventory. You are full. The grayed out ones are all your gear.
Right, 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 right. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Got it, got it, got it. I check if I need it. Got it. I sell it. So I never have an issue with bag space. Got it, got it. If you have space, but selling it. Selling it, right. If I'm filling it up so quick, then I'm going to have to fast travel to town every time just to sell the stuff. Because said I've got to go to Hogsmeade, right, to sell it. If I could sell it here, that'd be great. I'm just going to destroy it. Fuck it. Destroy it. Yes, it's annoying. That leather cap there that I'm never going to wear, 30 bucks. Destroy it. That shit fedora that I'm never going to wear. You will need the money later, so that's not a good idea. <laughs> right, for now though, just to get a few slots, we'll just destroy a few things. Right, I've got it now. We've got 20 slots, it goes all the way around. I was thinking it would they were all different. Thanks, 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 guys. We figured it out, man. Yeah, I've seen that. I don't want to put it on there. Nothing else in there. Quests. I've got something else in there, actually. Got something here. Page. I read it already. Something there. Yeah, that's stuff. That. Collections challenges. Right, quests. Right, we're right there, so just do that now while we're here. You said all three in the menu screen, right? On the map screen. Yes. Thank you, Liam. Hello, little dragonfly, mate. Right, where's this bloody thing you want? Let me come around to the pier. Let's go find it. Grace, what is it you needed my help with? I was hoping you could dive down and retrieve a treasured family astrolabe lost during a... That's it. How the fuck am I supposed to know where it is? This place is... Wait, wait, wait. There's got to be more to this. Wait, Bean. Do you remember this quest? There's no dive button. Wait a minute. Wait a fucking minute. Show me the controls, man. Where are they? You can't look at the controls. There, 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 there. Fucking dive. If you swim out far enough, there is a ripple to dive. Easier when you have a broom. Right. So, I've got to look for the ripple. Nothing looks different. <laughs> uh, maybe I should do this later. Like Fable. I never played it, bro. Xbox this only. must be where the Pinch Smedley family astrolabe right, hang is. Hang on, hang on, hang on. She's chatting, she's chatting. There we go. Founded it. Right. So it's, yeah, it's like Bean said, thingy spots. You don't actually dive. I got it straight away. Job done. I should let Grace know that I found her family astrolabe. No, go and sell it, man. Take it to town. And fucking flog it. Fill my damn slots up again now. <laughs> right, we're going to town, man. We're selling all this gear. A brushed wool cape. Uh, 
I think your book would be shagged, by the way. This is made of it. Maybe it's got a waterproof spell on it. I trust you didn't find the dive too terribly difficult. Hello, Grace. I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible! Did you find the astrolabe? Yes. It's yours for a price. Oh, fucking hell. Ah. I did. Just I hope it. it makes your father happy. It will. I can't wait to see his face. Thank you so much for doing this for me yeah. and for my family. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver of your caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. All right. Thank you again. And I do hope you keep diving. You certainly have a knack for finding treasure. The fuck are you, mate? Hey, you aren't a student, bro. Who are you? What are you doing around here? Look at this lovely little place. It's got money in it. It's locked. Hey, bud. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Hey, Arnie. Pardon me, is everything all right? Oh, Hardly. Right. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. Oh, I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ramrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your carts. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. It was nice meeting you. Yeah, you too. I wish it had been a little bit too much in this. You could all be a bit more succinct. Uh, take that damn scarf off, man. Sick of it clipping through my collar. Right, so I can't get in your gaff yet. What about this one? This one's open. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringos, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Orn. There they are. They are. Stopping the breakfast before they get down to the bridge. Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my potion shop. Did they ask you I you can were? answer any questions you have about the town. I asked you what you sell. Potion shop, that's all you have to say. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? You can help me with... Right, what does that do? It gives me durable rocky skin, increases my spell damage, and uh, aids in drink healing. I've got 520. They're all a bit expensive, mate. Yeah, I'll make my own. I hope to see you again sometime.
Music means enemies. No? It sounded like enemy music to me. What you was it? Mr. Goat? What's that? No problem, man. Hello, Roman. How art thou on this fine Sunday? I'm doing good, thank you, Jason. Jason, how are you, man? Enjoying a little uh, bit of exploration. Oh, sounds just got Glad to hear you it. let Nora Treadwell go, didn't you? You're about to wish you hadn't. Alright, mate. Incendio. So why are you waiting again to get Dragon Dogma? Just lots of reasons have put me off getting it, man. I don't think it's worth 60 quid. Um... So we're going to wait till it's a bit cheaper. No, don't get me wrong. I think it's worth 60 quid, but the 60 quid I had has now been spent on something that I'm going to get more use out of. Let me show you, man. The Dragon's Dog money has gone on this. Not the wheel, obviously, but the, the frame. How do I get this guy out of this? Uh, do I just burn him out? I don't want to burn him. Incendio. Sorry, man. Oh, shit. Potato. Oh, great. I missed the damn. Say thank you, mate. No, no, thank you, no, nothing, just disappears. Um, have you started playing it yet? Are you enjoying it? This place has seen better days. I heard something. You're the one. Yeah. Let me 
Someone get me down! It's up now! No match for me. Revenia. Past the ruins. I'm on the right track. What can I burn that up? Wood. No. Looks like there's some platforming to be done. Oh, hello. You're a big girl. Should we take care of you first? No. No, I've not uh, got to the curse book yet. People keep talking about that. It's, I think it's good. There's nothing even in there, man. Yeah, um, I made Luna and Lucy on it. I spent three hours making the fucking characters to play it. Uh, so I've got the characters ready, so that's one thing. When I do get around to playing the DD2, um, we won't have to sit through fucking two and a half hours of character creation. The other thing with it is, I don't know, maybe it's because I've played Dragon's Dogma 1 relatively recently. It just, it doesn't look like that different a game. You know what it reminds me of? Maverick or The Force Awakens. Both very similar to the, for like, Force Awakens very similar to um, Star Wars and New, A New Hope. And Maverick very similar to Top Gun. I was watching all the footage for you and I was just, get, I was just thinking, oh, this, even like some of the story beats are the same as the first game. So I don't know, man. My hype, my hype, a lot of it's been killed. Um, but it's still up there. I can't get this thing, can I? Yeah. Have I got to come back here as well? Like this wood thing. Can I break wood later or something? I guess. Why does she crouch down when I get in there like that? I need Liam or Bean probably for that one. I don't think I can do that yet. Has this appeared on the map though? No, does it fuck? Well, it does. Got kind of got that bit. Spider life. Have you got your broom yet? No, man. It's going to be a moment. That's for damn sure. Get out of it, man. Mm. 
An I guess we have to this must be it. pop balloons when we do get our broom, I presume. Looks as if there's more than one way to win. Levioso! <laughs> what? Wait. Any who oppose rent. Are... <laughs> what are you doing? I focus on the main quest. Until you get a broom for me, you can really explore the world. Yeah, I don't mind exploring at a slower pace, you know me, bro. Should have come in here. I don't think I should have come in here. I like how you get our frames though. Fuck you! Oh, I'm gonna heal some dead. Run away, I'm not supposed to be here yet. I'm obviously not supposed to be here yet. <laughs> Just steal the bolt. <laughs> right, get him out one at a time, yeah. One at a time, dude. Helio. Who's on the mill? What did I do? How do I make the thing grow up like the woman did? <laughs> um, so I get the Merlin thing. Do I need magic with a leaf on it? Or something. Have I got leaf magic? I ain't got no leaf magic. I don't know if that is leaf magic. I don't know. What are you for? Incendio! <laughs> Why are you glow white, man? I don't know if that means I can do something with you or not. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Hmm. 
Oh shit. That was quite something. Take that. Freon's carts. Take that, buddy. Or something over here. Hey, look, both. Get that. Yeah, but how do I get the balls for that one? Give me more balls. Shit. Give me these balls back. <laughs> uh, can I build one? <laughs> Fuck. Wait, there must be some more balls. Thoughts full again. Jesus Christ. Um. Use reviled spell to find the rest of the balls. Oh, right, I don't have that yet. So, if 150, destroy that. Oh, destroy this one. Reveal spell asterisk. Reveal. Right. These are worth money too. Right, I need to go sell this stuff, man. Done that. I fucking destroyed one of them five minutes ago. Right, Rebellion. reveal. To find the balls, there the balls, let's find the balls. Thank you, Liam. The carts are returning to on. They count as well. Can't go on the corners now. On the four thingies now. Ow. Oh. Right, where's the other thing then? There must be another fucking... Oh, it's right there. I'm blind. I'm guessing there's one more then, is there? Somebody's snoring. Or yawning, I should say. Fuck off! Gear slot me! Fucking gear slots, man! This is wild annoying! Honestly, like... Nighty, 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 nighty. Fucking you. Go. Go. Let me guess. No, actually, there's not. 
I was going to say, let me guess, you can buy something from DLC that gives you more gear slots, but I don't think there is any DLC for this, apart from that Dark Arts thing, innit? $17.99. So yeah, why have they decided to only give you such a limited fucking inventory? Mental. Mental, mate! Right, third one, Jason says. There it is. Outside. Excuse my balls. They added the bottleneck to slow down gameplay. Yeah, I guess so. You get more gear slots by doing something I these... can't remember. Maybe it's from the Merlin trials. Doing these, apparently, yeah. Uh, so I did have 20. And now I've got 20. Yay! What? Maybe I have to go inside and touch him first. Touch Merlin's dick. Hang on. I have to touch the thing, probably. Where is it? Where's the fucking... Here. Yeah. Gimme. No. Nothing, yeah? Right. Bean said it was the Merlin trials that give you more. It's on challenges. Um, Maybe to incentivize you to change your gear and see the shops more often. Yeah, maybe. What was it? Exploration. Merlin trials. Increased storage for gear, yeah? How about two? In so the spellbook challenge section, you have to accept. Oh, here. Yeah. How do I do that? I got a tick on it now. How do I get a tick on this one? Solve six. Oh, I've got to do six for the next one. Extra claim. Yeah, yeah, I'm an idiot. Okay. Fucking idiot. Is this on all these? Oh, I need seven of them. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. 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 I didn't realise you had to. I didn't realise I was playing a fucking MMO, mate. Uh, I didn't realise I was playing an MMO. Thanks. Right, so I've got some extra gear. <laughs> so how many slots did I add? 20 slots. Now I've got 24 slots. Yay! Uh, let's go to the shops, man, to sell all this shite. Alright, let's get to Hogsmeade. Let's just fast travel there. I was going over here, I think. Oh, no. What's this? Oh no, Brockborough. What's this? Keenbridge. Right. Anywhere will do. Take me to a flu flame. Travel. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Right. What have I come here for? I'll be back. Don't do anything crazy while I'm gone. Fucking forgot what I come here for, man. Sell, sell things. I'm going to presume I can do it to any shop, but it might have to be a tailor's shop. So let's go to the tailor's shop, just in case. Yo. Come on in, come Hi. on in. Don't be shy. Oh shit, can't I sell my stuff here? It's not time for a hairdo yet. You can stop by any time. Right, so you're not the tailor, you're Once just the you hairdresser. Get a piece of gear, you can use that appearance on anything yeah, else. I like that, I like that. I like transmog, man. 
Um, to be honest, I don't think gear is going to be that important. Because the game's not going to be difficult, is it? Or maybe it will be later. Maybe it'll ramp up a bit. And I'll want to pick some like good defensive stats or something, but... Can I sell you? Appreciate you having a look. Read all about it. Wait, you didn't even serve me before. You just stood around doing nothing to. Did I have a go at you? I had a go at you. Maybe I should put it up. I probably just play it on normal just to get through it. Um, who do I sell my stuff to, man? I can I sell it to anyone? Sell it in here. You're worrying far too much. Yeah. Nobody's looking at you. Look at that boy. Why did you buy oh. me a second pair? I hate these Novelty socks. Novelty socks at that price can't be passed up. Be thankful you have some. <laughs> have no socks than be dancing you ever like dancing? this. You're not dancing. You're exercising. <laughs> See? Um. <laughs> Come out in the wash, but it hasn't. I've never known someone so dramatic. <laughs> Lumos. Anyone would think you had an affliction. Oh, please, can't we take these socks back to Mr. Hill and get me some when normal ones? When you pay ones? for your own socks, then you get to choose. Until then, you'll learn to be thrifty and behave. You're starting to cause a scene. Papa, can we really wash charms out of things? Don't be absurd. That woman will say anything to avoid spending a canut. Who's been there all night if I leave him? Come on in and have a look around. Get your fucking money no out, mate. If you have sticky fingers. Get your money out, pal. Right. Prefect. Bye bye. If I haven't said it before, stupid it's a hat. Bye bye. Stupid glasses. Bye bye. Stupid hat. Bye bye. Capes. No capes. Bye bye. Silly hat. Cool coat. You go nowhere. That's my original robe. I think. Keep that. Midnight debonair. I like the name of it, so I'm keeping it. These can go. These are all that stupid man from the film. Fingerless gloves, I kind of like. But not as much as uh, the gloves I'm wearing. But I will keep them for now. Everything else can fucking go. There we go, 1800 buckaroonies. Now then, you got anything nice? You got nothing, mate. You've got absolutely sod all. See you later. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're You don't, about. it would seem. <laughs> I like how you can still hear him in the shop. Did you notice that? Listen. <laughs> Ready for a little change in fashion, are we? Plenty to choose sure. from here, so take your time. <laughs> That's nice, man. You can still hear him. Good, good uh, noise occlusion there. <laughs> Tapping away. Go on, man. You'll be alright. Don't worry about it. It's good to dance. Right. Back to school. Let's get a mission done. Fuck, man. Look at all this side combat. Uh, side content now. Um. Turn to on. Do that. That'll complete that and then go back. 
Wait, where you at, Arn? Fuck. A thousand meters away, mate. That's alright. In there in... Five hundred seconds. It's quite a long time. It's a very long time. If you're here for my wares... on, I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good and wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. The ones I faced were determined to make things difficult. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've Reward. inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. Lovely. What a nice idea, Reward. Ron. I wish you luck with it. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you again for all you've done. I feel like the lighting in those scenes aren't great at night time because the way they've chosen to do the dialogue. Lumos. All the best to you. If you're Once in the dark. Arrive, I'd be happy to show you my wares. Can't really see anything. Um, so basically, you're going to want to play as much as you can in the day. Which is easy. You just do that and press that. No, you don't. I thought you did. Press that. And then you press that. Have a little kip. Intriguing. What? What does? Is that thing swimming around? It's a bit of the beach. That's that puzzle. Might be that. Depends where a trigger is for that bit of uh, dialogue. Looks like it's that thing on the beach. in this house. Lumos. Wigan Weld. And money, I guess. In the toilet. In the dunny. Somebody still lives here. They've just stolen their fucking money.
Very higgledy piggledy, isn't it? This is where the thing is. Oh, while we're here, then we might as well have the bank. While we're here, while we're here, while we're here. Hello, Lucan. Is the final round of Crossed Ones ready? Big match today. It all comes down to this. The moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. I better go solo Ready then. for a shot at glory? I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? I took that scarf off. I'll go to Lola. Then let's get started. Thanks, bro. We can make this a real victory. That's the spirit. Wait. I want a partner. I thought I'd be one on one if I didn't have a partner. What the fuck is this? What? I'm not close enough. Health have you got? Fuck. Natty! I took on more than I can fucking bit off more than I could chew. They made a crop's breakfast out of you that round. Well when you said solo, Let's mate, I thought you meant 1v1. Let's go, but yes, get, uh, give me Natty now. this time. Very well. Good luck out there. With Natty? Oh you bastard. He's not gonna ask me this time. <laughs> I can too. One at a time, man. Is bullshit. Care to try again? Well, yeah, but one one minute. No, I don't think so. Not right now. Understandable, but don't take too long. We'll be waiting. All right, you snot nosed little shit. Where's Nay? Get off. Nay! Yo, I need you. Hello there. I'm sorry. I know I didn't call you just, but I didn't realize. I thought it was going to be one on one. I didn't realize. No, don't give me the cut. Right, okay. You're coming with me this time, though, right? You're coming with me this time, okay. Right, she's ready, she's ready. 
She's forgiven me, man. Hello, Lucan. Is the final round of Crossed Ones ready? Look who's back. Ready to redeem yourself? Sure, up, redeem myself. What are you on about? I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? Of course. Natty, like always. Yes, Natty. Then let's get started. Indeed. We can make this a real victory. <laughs> That's the spirit. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck it, Come on. Incendio. There goes my way. I pressed it. Yes, that'll fit. It won't be too late, bro. It'll be probably a... Uh... Hang on, mate. I can't pause. Yes, I can. It'll probably be about... Let me think. Probably another hour of this. That'll take me up close to 7. Probably about 9pm for me. My time, somewhere like that. So about probably about 2pm 2, 2 for you. Somewhere around there, I'll think. Um... Alright, Bean. Take care. Have a good day. Thanks for dropping by, guys. Take care. Um, so yeah, probably about 2 p.m. your time, if Shelfie. Keep an eye out, bro. If I remember, I'll send you a message beforehand. You help, you know what? Fizz wouldn't be just fizzing. Care to try again? Yes. Yes, I'm ready now. Very well. Good luck out there. Sure, man. Don't need luck. Don't need you to tell me what to do either. <laughs> Yo, stupid fire. How do I do that? I forgot. I forgot about that one. Attacking me! Attack Natty as well! What the fuck, bro? Why are we not even dead yet? What? Shut up! What's going on? Care to try again? Yes! Yes, I'm ready now. Very well. Good luck out there. Come on then. Class, are you going to be extremely late for? Uh, Jedi survivor class. Yeah. 
Fuck off, bro. Potato. She does say potato. Right, one down. Better, better, better. Wait, how has she got back up? Took her out once. Help me out from behind, yo! Fuck me! Nay! You're better off on my own! Care to try again? Yes! Yes, I'm ready you now. You think I'm quitting? Well. You Good fucking must there. be mad! Here! Lock on! I'm fucking lock on. Yeah, come here. Come here. Come here. She's dead, yeah? Fuck. What is going on? It's getting harder. Care to try again? Yes. Yes, I'm ready now. Very well. Good luck out there. Thank you. But stay back. I'm being too... Uh... Too aggressive. Too aggressive. Use these as well. Use these straight away, man. Get rid of the shield. Fuck, oh, man. I'm dead already. Oh, fuck off, man. Leave me alone, man. Pick on that E. Take a breath, take a breath, take a breath, take a breath. Care to try take again? A take a breath, yes, yes I do. Just one second. Alright, don't run straight in because the lock on breaks for some reason at the beginning of the fight. Yes, I'm ready now. It doesn't work Very for well. about the first Good 10 luck seconds. Out there. Just wait. Oh, okay, can't lose the There we go. For some reason, it's just wank. Where are you going? Let me 
recommended. Oh, finally! Surely, yes. Well done, Natty. I'll sign up for a round. What a victory! Uh, you won the tournament. You can use is deadly once you unlock the ability to use them. Yeah, I've not done herbology yet or um, potions, so I think that's next, next, the next lessons. I'm just getting started, bro. That was nothing. I'm just getting started. If the best duelists in the school weren't enough competition. Then perhaps you should consider transferring to Dernstrang. Now, to the victor goes the prize! And so it is my great honour to present you with this simple yet elegant token of supreme dueling accomplishment! I don't know that I deserve that, mate. I'm flattered, but I don't deserve that's, such uh, an honour. Let's uh, entertain Come now. him. Oh, the undisputed winner! I kind of like this guy. in your accomplishment. Now that we've definitively crowned the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. Right. Da, da, da. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Ba 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 ba. We'll get to herbology, yeah. See you in there, Natty. Uh, greenhouse. Again. I love the. Uh, I'm gonna look at it too long because it's probably copy pasted. Actually, there's a difference. No, they've done a pretty good job there, making each pain a little bit different. Uh, you know what? I'll give it to them. Sometimes you look at something like that. Each Every other pain will be the same or something, but good distinction. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented blue powder. This would be my mum's favourite place. Hello.
Hello. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora, dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little garlic popular. Oh, hello. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing bowl. <coughs> now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Accio. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. Look at all, big your ears. Now, everyone, grip the mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. <laughs> the soil should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Repair. I was going to say, should I do that? But you got it. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Now for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I should think Professor Garlic would be more careful with her mandrakes. I wonder if hippogriffs like knockgrass. Yes, Professor? Firstly, well done with your mandrake. Thank you. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. I'll say. I nearly went deaf. Well, yes. Of course, the cry of a mature mandragora can be fatal. So remember to keep those ears protected. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Picked them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. It wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Um, right. Okay, I can only do healing stuff. That'll do. Every ten minutes I get five. Well done! Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. I met him. Now, briefly. What say we branch out? You seem Introduce a bit panicky you to about a something. Different sort of flora. The Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. Mr. Pruitt. Is that you? The best time to plant a seed is last you're season. Clocked. The second best time is now. 
I do wonder about Professor Fig. He's hardly ever in his classroom. Most strange. Don't know Prue it here, man. I was that in by the door. Are you Prue? Hello. Saw you on your way okay. to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. Those are my favourite. Chinese chomping cabbages. You're Prue it. Up these stairs will take us there. But your lead. What do you mean I'll lead? You try and look at my horse, mate. Ah, I got a little too quick for you. Ba, ba, nice ba, work ba, in defence against the dark arts, by the way. Ba, ba, Excuse me? Ba, ba, Your duel with Sebastian. Ba, 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 and he's good. Ba, ba. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you are yeah. right slaughtered him. All right, Pruitt. Stop simping, oh. bro. Wow, thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place myself. Did you really? I, mean, I would have, if Hecate yeah. had stopped me. Oh, definitely you would have. Didn't she stop that dragon skull from... Here we are. Home of the Chinese chomping plants saved my ass many times. I presume that what you were talking about just now, when you were saying, uh, just toss the cabbages at it, use them, they'll do the rest in the fights. Look at that! They'll chomp on anything they can get their mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? Oi, my kind language. Of Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. Hey, I like booba tubers. <laughs> Not saying you can't go it alone. I like bouncing bulbs too. Well, imagine that wasn't booba the tubers are my favourite kind of tubers. Okay, bro. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and Death Cat has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take yeah, your time. Dear the I'll see you back in class. Don't tell me what to do, mate. I want to take my time. I'll take my time. If I want to hurry up, I'll hurry up. You're getting a bit too familiar there, son. We've only just met. You know that. I did it, Professor. As to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves, I shall end our lesson here. Terribly sorry, Mr. Clopton. I attended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. Let's have a chat now before I leave. These mandrakes are really relishing their new pots. Oh, okay. Only cost me my damned hearing. Right, so that's cool. When you... Basically, it waits until you choose the class for your um, quest, and then it makes the students walk to the class, right? And obviously, when you finish the quest, everybody walks away. That's good. It's good. <coughs> Whereas in Bully, for instance, you were just on a timer. Once the bell went, you had to get to class. It's a relief to finally have an answer as to why that portrait was empty. Luke and Brattleby must have nearly wet himself when you won every single crossed once battle. You put your wand away, mate. You're walking around with your wand out. Big red, with your big red tip. What's he doing, this guy? Rebellion. Put your fucking wand away, mate. Keep an eye on him. 
Right, um, start. Quests. Potions. Watch you back that way. Right, this way. Dum ba di bi di dum do do dum. Maybe Aura is someone from the Ministry guarding the school. Very innocent and hogs me. Professor what Black the hell was that? It was making him completely incompetent, which he is. Lumos. Sitting on the floor for. He knows more than he's letting on about the Goblin Rebellion. is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Point for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld Potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. Thank you, and sir. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time round. Bro, where's your office? Should you chop the Dittany or crush it? The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss of your eyebrows. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of a goblin rebellion. I tell you, students, I'm curious to see what you do. He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. No. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy Don't with potions, even if I do think say so about myself. About asking me to Pleasure steal to something, you. mate. Wait, are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. 
but she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Ajuras potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will no. add that extra spark. Get it yourself. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. Get it yourself, mate. I simply mate. need a single fupa feather. As you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission, perhaps you could grab it for me. I don't know, Gareth. I don't want to get on Sharp's bad side. You won't. Fupa feathers aren't that valuable. Get it yourself. Sharp won't even miss it. Get it yourself. I have enough to worry about collecting the ingredients he wants me to get. I'm afraid I can't help you. I understand. I'll sort something else out. Get me in trouble on my fucking first week in school, mate. Your potion should not be there. <laughs> gold. Precision is key when brewing potions. I think it's a test. That's Slugworth and Willy Wonka. Steal an everlasting gobstopper. The one who doesn't steal it. It's a test, man. That's sharp. I ain't stupid. I've seen Willy Wonka, man. Proficiency in potions are two things that cannot be rushed. Have patience right. and be thorough. What? Let make that. Let's sit and watch that shit. What house did you choose? Hufflepuff. What about you? Points to have them cast. And now we add the mallow sweet, and that's odd. Basically, what's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Uh -uh. Get it! Done. What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. Gryffindor. Go ahead. Now, Mr. Weasley. Basically, they um, I looked it up beforehand, like ages ago when I was going to get the game before, to see what differences there were, and um, the general consensus was Hufflepuff was best because you you get to go to Azkaban. There's a mission where you go to Azkaban with Hufflepuff, so. I thought I'd pick it for that. That's the only reason, really. Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. Yo, I did it. I brewed an Edoras potion as you asked, Professor. Glad you managed to stay on task. Not every class is so eventful. I saw Mr. Weasley speaking with you earlier. He can be quite persuasive. Glad you managed to resist. You've done well today. I confess I was... Skeptical, given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. Getting that, In though, addition sir. to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. I'll just use a classroom, man. You're fine. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Professor Sharp must have learned a lot during his time in Aura. I wish he talked about it more. That was an interesting class. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. But for certain, you'd have helped. 
I'm glad I don't even know you mean sharp certainly seemed upset with you his barks worse than his bite I think deep down he respects my artistic spirit sharp may seem gruff but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day best be off next time we talk I promise fewer explosions wait a few galleons a portrait in our common room wants to talk to you it's Eldritch Diggory he used to be the minister for magic I think is that what the money's called in Harry Potter? Galleons. Galleons are fucking ship. Did he did he mean to say doubloon? Did you mean to say doubloon, bro? Did you mean to say doubloon? We talk about galleons. Don't ignore me. I fucking know. I just bowed to you, man. You're gonna bow to me. Oh no! You don't bow to me, no. Just Weasley. Okay, I get it. You sure? You sure you don't want to bow? That's better. Better. So some damn respect when I can walk past. of a new hero. Damn, how high does this thing go? And I know it's okay, fine I think I the the ass, but master lock picking as soon as possible. I want to because there's fucking locks all over the place, bro. Um so yeah, I will do once I get an opportunity to. Cause I must have wandered by fifty fucking padlocks so far. Wanted to oh. see me, sir? Indeed. Allow me to introduce oh. myself. So few students know who I am these days. Allow myself Heldridge to introduce Diggory, myself. Former Minister for Magic and founder of the Aura Recruitment Program at your service. I believe you can help solve a decades old murder thanks to that book you found oh. and, in particular, its missing pages. How do you know about the book and the pages? We portraits hear more than you might suspect and... Most of us can keep a secret. So, what say you? Surely a Hufflepuff such as yourself would be inclined to help seek long overdue justice. Justice must be served. Murder sounds intriguing. This could be right up my street. Even we Hufflepuffs enjoy a good mystery. Glad to hear you are up to the challenge. 
Plus, I believe you'll benefit from this undertaking. My great niece, Helen Thistlewood, can provide you with details. She's retired now, but was a skilled aura in her day. And the unsolved murder mm. of which I speak was her case. I often visit my portrait in her home, in the nearby hamlet of Upper Hogsfield. Shall I tell her to expect you? Yes. Tomorrow. I shall go and see her right away. Brilliant. With Tomorrow. what I suspect is your knack for hard work and her keen mind, both mysteries may be solved sooner than you think. I shall see you there soon, I hope. Tomorrow. Because I am going to take a break now. And then later, I'll be back with Star Wars Jedi Survivor Part 5, whatever it is I'm on. Uh, yeah, probably in the next couple of hours. Probably before 9-ish. UK time. 10pm. Europe. 4pm. Eastern. 2pm. Western. Adios amigos, au revoir mes amis, arrivederci, mi amici, I'll be the same, my friend, sayonara, dovit zenya, zajian, alvida, good night, love you long time, see you next time, take care of yourselves, but most importantly, take care of each other, namaste, hi, streamius endius.